Okay, welcome newbies <laughs> or anyone that wants to relaunch, I guess. It's good for anyone. This is really just like oh. kind of starting at the beginning and just kind of giving you an overview and first steps. That's what we're going to try to keep it to today. Um, so I'm Jackie Wilson and I am a triple diamond. If you are on our Diamond Empire page, then I'm your upline. Hi. <laughs> uh, I know that we shared this with a few pages. So um, I've been with It Works since May of 2014. So I've been with them a long, long time. Um, I don't know how long that's been, but a long time. Um, I guess, and okay, I'll, I'm gonna introduce Laura really quick and then I'll go back to me and then I'll tell my story. So this is Laura. <laughs> She is one of my leaders on my team. She's incredible. Do you want to introduce yourself really quick? Um, I have been with works for about six months now, and it has together, and it's been really amazing. Like, I've met most people. And I was really excited to do training tonight because it really is going to get everyone started and on the right. Please, me. You're totally cutting in and out. Hello. Continue. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's, I feel like your internet is working normally and just right now it's just deciding because we're doing an actual training that it doesn't want to work. It was fine earlier. Maybe it's just the time of day. Should we just give it a minute and we'll come back? I'll give you a minute. We'll maybe let it settle and then we'll come back. Okay, so come back to me. <laughs> um, I'll just give you a quick overview of kind of where I was before this, just if you don't know who I am, which most likely if you're new, you don't know who I am. So um, like I said, I've been doing this since May of 2014, but I feel like more important than that, I was actually asked to do this by Courtney Vogelsang, who is um, our presidential diamond upline. Um, I was asked to do this by her and I actually ignored her and then told her no. And I feel like that's such an important part of my story because, you know, when you start something like this and you start to talk to people, not everyone is going to care about their health. Like just not everyone's going to care about their skin and their health and making extra income. Not everyone will. Or they just are some weird mindset where they think they don't. And that's okay. It's okay if you get a no. And I feel like I just want to say that off the bat because I said no. <laughs> and I totally ignored Courtney. And then I came back and stalked her on Facebook, even though she had no idea I was stalking her. I was watching every post that she made and watching everything that she said. And I eventually came back and was like, okay, what is this all about? Um, and so it's okay if you get it now is what I'm saying. And so I was working full time. I did not start this to make a full time income. I'll just say that I didn't know that you could make a full time income with this. Like I just didn't realize that was a thing. And so I was working on corporate America. I had just got my master's degree. I think the year before, two years before, um, I was a newlywed, didn't have any kids was just me and my husband and my dogs working in corporate America. And I was busy. And so when I say I'm busy, I wasn't just like sitting at a desk, you know, going to work, sitting at a desk. I was actually driving in my car all the time. So my job required me to drive all over central and South Florida. And I feel like that's important because people always tell me how busy they are. And if you say that you're busy, I totally get it because I was busy and I couldn't just be like texting someone on the side or like posting something. I was driving in the car that was really dangerous. And so I had to literally fit this in the nooks and crannies of my day. I was busy and I just had to fit it in where I could. Um, and so I was just really intentional. And honestly, like I used to watch a lot of TV and just like, I don't know, scroll Facebook. I don't even know what I did, but I did stuff. And I figured if I'm already sitting there watching like three hours of TV a day or whatever the heck I'm doing, I could be putting some of that time towards growing a business. Why not? And so I had like 129 Instagram followers and like 300 Facebook friends. And I was really shy and introverted. And I really cared what people thought of me. And I probably seemed like the least successful person at this that you could possibly find and in my first month I crushed my $450 goal that was my big goal and I was like if I could do that in like six months that'd be awesome 
And my first month then I did that and I actually just kept promoting as I'm working full time, still working full time, still super busy, um, promoted to, you know, a bunch of levels up and was making a five figure monthly paycheck in 12 months with this company, which might seem a little like unreal and mind blowing because probably if I was new and I was sitting on a zoom, I'd be like, yeah, <laughs> right. <laughs> from social media, like, <laughs> um, but it's true. It's true. And that's just the reality of it. I was able to retire myself from my corporate job about 10 months into doing this. And so it's just been amazing. This has been our, our thing. It's been paying off our debt. It's been, I mean, I could name a bunch of different stuff. When I got pregnant with my son, he came about a month early and I was able to just stop life and just be with him. My husband was home for three weeks. He was a server. My husband was a server back in the day. And so I was just able to be, he was able to be home with us. He didn't have, we didn't have to worry about him making money during those three weeks. We were just home together as a family, hanging out, like doing whatever. And then he actually dropped down to working part-time at his job so he could finish his bachelor's degree. We didn't have to take out student loans. Like my son only knows waking up and hanging out with me. And it's not because I was able to be a stay-at-home mom. Like I'm, I'm no offense to my husband we just weren't making up money it wouldn't have been possible and so because of this I've been able to do all of these things and travel all the time and pay our bills and just it's just been incredible and I never expected that it was not what I set out for but once I realized what the possibility was I started dreaming and dreaming and dreaming and just working hard and telling people where I was going and here we are. And so this year, um, I want to be a top 50 team. And that's my big goal this year for us. I want us to be able to say like, I'm on a top 50 team. And I want you all to be here with me. Because honestly, a year from now, my story could be your story. You know, we've are one of our ambassador diamonds up our upline. Um, she went ambassador in a year. That's the top of the company. She I mean, I've seen her like legit paychecks. Like, <laughs> I'm like, Amanda, what are you really making? Um, I've seen her real paychecks and she was making a $30,000 paycheck a year in. How insane is that, you guys? I don't even know where you could make that much money. Like, I don't even know. That just sounds nuts. So whether you're in this just to make a few extra hundred dollars or you're in this to like go all the way to the top, we can show you how to do all of that. We're here for it. Um, okay, so let's try your internet again, Laura. I just want you to tell like a little bit of your story about how you got started because I feel like <clears throat> Of course. Am I there? Yes. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> so yeah, my name is Laura. Um, when I started this business, I was actually reaching out and looking around because I also was kind of the breadwinner of our family. Um, I was serving, but I was making extremely good money and I fell and broke my ankle. Um, so I couldn't serve anymore because you can't serve on a hard cast. Like it doesn't work that way, right? <laughs> so um, I had reached out to Jackie because she's always posting and literally I've been following her because we were a part of a Disney group together. And yeah, we both love Disney. Um, so I was like following her, following her. And finally I reached out and I'm like, okay, what are you doing that your life looks so freaking amazing? Because <laughs> I need help. <laughs> so she explained it to me and like, okay, whenever someone explains something like this to me, it always sounds so like it's, it's we're in a, era of things being like skeptical like it is what it is I like really didn't honestly believe her all the way <clears throat> but after talking to her for a little bit more and like I did feel a lot more comfortable with her and we got to the whole like $99 things you guys I was so crushed that this thing costs money and yes duh it's a business that's going to cost money however I was broke we were hurting we were behind on our mortgage our car was gonna get repossessed like we were okay this lady is telling me that if I take this leap of faith that this is going to change my life so I had to do it and I literally went out to my storage um, I had like a little storage thing out back and I found an AC window unit and I sold it and at the time I just stashed the money because I knew if I didn't put it away somewhere that it was going to you know be taken away or be used for something else that we did need like phones and stuff <laughs> so uh, Jackie came to me and just like some of you that are on here got in on that deal which is amazing. And she was like, I have a, a code for you. She's like, are you able to do this? I was like, oh my God, I literally have that much money. So that right there like was telling me that this was the leap of faith and this was faith telling me to make this leap. And I ran to the bank, put it in. I'm like, let's run my car now because it's going to get declined. If we don't do it, someone else is going to take it. <laughs> and then I just, I took the leap of faith guys and I went all the way in. 
I didn't sit back and I didn't wonder. That night I watched all the videos and I asked Jackie all the questions and I just ran and ran and ran because I knew that I needed this. So I just took that leap of faith and followed Jackie. <laughs> It was fun because our, her first month in was um, in June and um, they do a top enroller Zoom. So the top well, customer <laughs> enrollers, the top distributor enrollers, and people that complete their steps of success um, get to go on this special Zoom with one of our corporate, our top corporate people. Yes. Um, and it, it's an honor to be on that Zoom. And so she was on it her first month in because she had just, she just made a decision. That's really what it is. I know that it can be new and scary and you're like, I don't even know what the heck I'm doing and that's fine. <laughs> didn't either but when you just make a decision and you're just like I'm gonna figure it out because if all these other girls and I see all these other people doing it it has to be something that I can do too that's what we both thought and that's why we just ran so fast and so hard so um anyway I just want to, whatever you're here for I want to go to basics really quick um so your first goal with the company is four loyal customers in your first 30 days. And the reason that's your first goal is because when you get your first four customers in your first 30 days, you get a hundred, uh, was it a hundred dollars product credit? Yeah. Yeah. Um, a hundred dollars in product credit or, and so you can go get whatever products you personally want to use, or you can get products to sell because we sell, you know, <coughs> samples and things like our own personal stuff in person. Like we don't have inventory. You probably already know that. Um, but whatever we have in person, we're able to sell. And so I'll sell coffee samples to people or wrap samples and things like that. Um, so also before I keep going, if you guys do have questions along the way, you can use a little chat and you can ask questions there too. Um, okay. So first goal for loyal customers, all a loyal customer means, and you don't have to write this down. We have the wording already for you. Um, but a loyal customer is just someone, think of it like Costco, like a Costco membership. You know how you have to pay to be a Costco member, but then you get a wholesale discount. So you can pay a $50 fee to be a loyal customer or the, the option that like 99.9% .9 of my customers choose is they will do one product a month for three months. <clears throat> Super flexible. You can change the product. You can change the date. There's no minimum. I think the cheapest product is like 25 bucks or something. So it's not yep. super expensive and they can just try either the same product. So if it's someone doing weight loss, clearly I'm probably going to keep them on the same products every month so that they can have that three months of time to you know lose weight because weight loss is not an instant you know an instant thing um so or you know if it's someone that like wants to try some skincare they can try one product whatever they want to do um so those are the two options to be a loyal customer like i said we have all the wording and everything so if you are talking to people like come to someone and just be like what do i say and i promise you we will help you um because i did not know how to talk to people when i started this and we'll chat about that a little bit later but I pretty much sucked at this when I started. So, um, Screenshot it and send it to your upline. We'll help. Post on the page. And <laughs> someone will answer you right away. Um, okay. Hopefully this works. I'm going to share my screen really quick. <clears throat> oh. Wait, hold on. I don't know why it allows you to share my screen. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. Come on. <laughs> what is this? System preferences, security and privacy. I think it's because I just um, updated my software on my computer. <laughs> it's like something would happen during our Zoom. Oh, okay. I think I have to just check this. Wait. <clears throat> oh, no. Uh -oh. Okay. Well, okay. Hold on. <laughs> it's, if I click this, it says it's going to... Wait, let me just see if that worked. Let's just see. Sorry. You guys. <clears throat> oh, it worked. Okay. I think it's because I updated my software because I was always able to do this. Oh, there's like different options now. Okay. All right. Here is eSuite. Hold on. Let me move this. So you, if you haven't been in eSuite yet, eSuite is like our backend reporting system. Um, I'm just going to quickly show you everything. There's really not a lot that you're going to do in here right now, but I just wanted to show you so that you saw it. Um, okay. So commissions will tell you your commissions for the month. There won't be anything in there yet because you're new. Um, reports. The two reports that I mostly use, um, so when you open this up, click additional reports, is Tree Viewer right here and Organization Explorer. You can go look at those two, but those are the two that you're probably gonna use most often, Organization Explorer and Tree Viewer. So the rest of them, I know they're all there. Don't get overwhelmed. I honestly don't go into a lot of them, so don't worry about it. Um, okay, let me go into document. 
library really quick. So there is a ton of marketing materials in here. Um, if the one thing that I do want you guys to go print out download or whatever if this will actually load when you go in here type ruby and you'll see ruby chart ruby rank chart right here and you can download the pdf of it um, go do that whenever you have a minute and download that because that is probably going to be your first goal um, we'll talk about that in a little bit so like i said there's all this stuff in here product info like <clears throat> it used to be in here oh i think they took it out actually i'll show you you have ruby it. typed in that's why oh oh <laughs> there it is. <laughs> but I'll show you an easier. Oh no, see, they did get rid of it most of it. I thought that they were. Yeah. I'll show you in a little bit an easier, a, a good place to go. Okay, so auto ships. I'm going to show you how to change it really quick. Um, so, this, so your auto ship, this is how it works. There's two ways to be commission qualified, which means you're good to get your paycheck every single month, right? Um, if you do neither of these, nothing happens. There's no penalty, but this is the two ways that you can be commission qualified. Number one, either have, it's basically like, it's 150 volume, which I know is a super new term for you. So basically think of it like $150 in sales. And if you think of it like <clears throat> wraps are 54 volume, so three wraps customers, or I'm just making it easy, simple math, would be <laughs> like, so your first four customers most likely will get you really close to that number. Um, especially if they're getting multiple products. But I have ran my auto ship every month. So it used to not be 150. When I started, it was 400 which is a lot of customers to get in your first month. And so, and I knew I wanted to try products anyway. I feel like if you're using the products and you're, and people are seeing you use the products, like every day I'm showing how I'm making my coffee, simple switches. I'm making my coffee. I mean, I used to drink coffee anyway, so I just started drinking ours. Um, I shower and wash my face. And so I switched <laughs> to our face wash, you know, like <laughs> thing I, knew I could fit into my diet. Our greens, my, myself and my son actually both drink the chocolate greens. Um, so I started with simple things that I knew I could switch into my, into what I was already doing so that I, people could see me using them. I could have my own testimony, which I think is so, so huge. Um, and so we have such a huge range of products. So just go look at the website and think like what would be the best for me to use. Um, and so I'm going to edit mine just to show you how easy this is. So you just click edit. Um, oh, and so the other option, like I said, is the auto ship is 80 BV. So I will show you exactly what that means. <clears throat> um, so you're going to go down. I'm going to change items. So if you didn't know already, we have an amazing skincare line and we work <laughs> with, um, uh, where's the thing? Is it over here? We worked with, here, I'm just going to delete this. If you've ever seen the show Botched on E, we worked with one of the doctors, one of the plastic surgeons on there to create three new products that we just launched like a couple months ago, which is right here. And I, I had them in my auto ship. So there's like a pack of them, which is cool. So it's our lash serum, our neck firming cream, because I know I'm not that old, but I got like a tech neck line going on. And then so anyway, this is how easy it is to go through. So I'm going to change mine. I'm going to go over here and shop by category. Um, I want to put defining gel on there because I'm running out and I use defining gel as my lotion after I shave. I also use it for random. Defining gel has tea tree oil in it. Here it is. And I actually, when I get out of the shower, I have like borderline psoriasis in my, in my scalp. I know TMI, but it actually really helps. It helps for a lot of skin issues. So I'm going to add this. If I need more of that. I was running out. Um, I'm also running out. I use our entire skincare line. I'm like obsessed with it. Um, Anti-aging. <laughs> um, I'm going to put more of our radiance. It's got like hyal hyaluronic acid in it. I'm running out of that. So add to cart. And then what was the other thing that I wanted? I'm going to put shop by category. Oh, I'm going to put... Um, our celery. So our just celery, I know it sounds super weird, you guys, and I was like kind of weirded out when I first heard about it, but <laughs> Laura doesn't like it because she doesn't like celery. But if you can withstand the taste of celery, um, it actually helps immensely with bloating. So if someone's looking for weight loss and they can withstand the taste and smell, it's really honestly very mild. I think it's very mild. Laura's a baby. It's fine. <laughs> 
I love you. Okay, so you can see this is more than <laughs> can be. So I'm put, that's what I do. So I'm gonna check out and then continue. <clears throat> shipping, you can choose a different shipping if you want to. I don't need a different shipping. Use my primary card. It'll default to whatever card you used when you set up your when you whatever. Um, and then just save, <laughs> save your options at the very end. But you see how right here it says it says 100 BV because that's what I put in there. But you can just make it up to eight, like 80, um, in a minimum of 80, and that's what you should be doing every single month. And like I said, like you could rely, you know, you could just get the 150 um, in customer volume and that's fine. Um, if one of your customers cancels or something happens, I've seen people like not get paid that month or um, I just honestly, I know that if I'm using the products and people see me using the products then they're going to be more intrigued to use them too. And I can take selfies with them and have my own personal stuff. So that's it. That was super easy, right? Change my auto ship. So you can go in there. It will default to something and you can just change it to whatever you want. Don't have to do anything with settings, although if you ever don't know what your website is, click settings and on the left, click website. <clears throat> and this is your website right here. And you can always come in and change it right here. You just change this and it will change this part. I think it's easy when it's your name. So. Also, mm -hmm. on the side of this under my uh, the account over to the left is your 1099 forms. If you haven't been in your e-suites yet and done that, you will want to click on your 1099 forms and fill that out so that you can begin your sales. I think that it just pops up right when you log into eSuite. It will pop up and force you. Yeah, it does at the tax. top red. Yeah. There'll yeah. be a red bar that pops up. But if you didn't see that, then it's yeah. another spot to get it. Yeah, you definitely want to just, just confirm that like your social security number or whatever is correct and whatever. You'll be fine. Okay. Um, <laughs> the other thing I did want to show you guys really quick in orders. So I don't usually create separate orders. Um, you can. I just usually run an auto ship. So I just unless I need extra product for an event or something, I don't know. But every two customers that you that you get started, you get a, a wrap, they used to call them wrap rewards. Now they call them product rewards. I'm very old. Okay, so product rewards right here on the left. You will see every two customers you will have one of these product rewards. And so that means a discounted product. So normally the, the pack of four body wraps is $59. It's discounted to 25 and you don't pay for shipping. The facials are the same. They're discounted to 25 for 59. You don't pay shipping. The coffee is discounted from 39 to 20. You don't pay shipping. And then the energy is discounted to 20, I think too. 19. I don't know. Something random. Something. <laughs> So I just wanted to like point that out really fast. If you ever needed to enroll a customer or distributor yourself, you would also come right here in orders at the orders at the top. On the left, it says enroll new customer. You can enroll a new loyal customer or distributor right here. Okay, so that's kind of e-suite. There's really nothing else. Um, I'm gonna stop share right quick because I wanna show you my phone really quick. If you haven't downloaded the Connect app, I think it prompts you to download it when you get started but the one thing in here that I think well there's a few things but there's one thing that I particularly <laughs> think is so amazing and it's kind of newer within this past year is you can create a shopping cart okay so connect right oh hold on let me turn my thing down so you can see my screen I can kind of see it okay so oh my god this is ridiculous <laughs> <laughs> it's like if you put it too low then you no one can see it okay so connect. So if you scroll down on the main screen of connect, you will see it says shopping lists. You see that? So shopping lists is amazing because when people want like three different products because they want to lose weight and you're like, okay, go to the website and click here and click there and click there and click that and add to cart. And they're just like, ah, so you can make a cart for them. So you just go in here and then you create a new list. And it will show you all the products right here and you can scroll down and so say that they wanted ultimate body applicator aka our body wrap you just click this little plus it's hard to do from the other side and then you oh and then you just click save or just click add or whatever yeah save and then it will give you so then you press send and it will give you the actual link and it'll put it up in an email, but you can just copy that link and text it. 
I feel like that is so important because it's so much easier. Even if they just want one product, honestly, I usually just make them a shopping cart because I feel like it's so easy and they just go in, it takes them right to the checkout and they're done. So anything else that I want to say from eSuite or any of that? I feel like it's just boring stuff. <coughs> no, I think we covered eSuite. And... That's eSuite and your Connect app. Oh, in the Connect app, you also, there is, um, there is some training in here. Yeah, there's training videos that you can watch that kind of introduce you to it works in the products. You click there, it'll say day one, day two, day three. So there is some training in there that corporate gives us. You can go look at that too. Those, those are the videos I was talking about that I slammed into the first night that I started. <laughs> I, you guys, I just, yeah, I just started. I never really watched <laughs> corporate training. I should not say that on a video. You should go watch it. But I just was like, I just want to start. What do I do to start? Just get me started. I just want to make the money. So whatever. You do what you want. Um, okay. So I just really quick, I'm going to share my screen one more time and just show you um, the team page really quick. I know you already know what it looks like, but just to show you a couple things. So, um, in our team page, this is our Diamond Empire page. So if you're not in here, you're group has the same things in it, right? So it doesn't really matter if you're in my page, whatever page you're in, there's going to be a file and there's probably going to be a get started list. And so we have like a, I'm new, where do I start? So there's going to be files in your team page that look like this and you can go in there and you can get started that way. If you're someone that likes to read or in the photos, when you click photos, you can go to albums and I guarantee your team page has this as well. And there are all the different products there's different examples of like how to post about the products and you can go read someone else's because I was someone that I was like I don't know how to post anything what do I do so I went in I just read I just read other people's posts and made them my own or how do I post about the business I'm new what do I say you know and so I would go in there and I would just read other people's and honestly just like not copy and paste it but use the idea or whatever until I kind of figured out what I was doing so you can feel free to use like any of these. So for instance, we have, if you click in here, there's different, um, these are the exact uh, sizing for Instagram and Facebook stories. You know, it's stories like where you can click through like the little <coughs> clips. So you can use like any of this stuff. I'm gonna be updating more in here, but any of these before and after photos and things like that, we're gonna be updating it, but you can feel free to use any of those. If someone's asking about a product, I try to give them a before and after photo because um, I just feel like people need to see the results, you know, that they want to get. So, all right, is that all the boring stuff out of the way? <laughs> yeah. Yay, getting started. <laughs> yeah, like that's the basics, there you go. That's everything. Um, okay, so let's actually talk about how to get started, <laughs> like really get started. Um, cause that was Laura and I, we just jumped in. So, um, like I said, your first goal is for loyal customers and you're going to get that hundred dollars credit. So can we talk really quick about what we did? What did you do to get your first four customers? Uh oh, did you went about, <clears throat> excuse me, sharing, posting and sharing and messaging. Um, now, am I still here? Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah. <laughs> so we went um, talking in to talking. We know that are going to like our products, and you know, make a list of your friends and family that you think are going to enjoy and like your. Products. Um, I knew that my family, because I had a very little market, um, wasn't going to be interested. So I did, you know, ask because whatever, nose or nose, and moving on. <laughs> but I had to grow my network very fast. So I immediately started to grow my network and that was my a big one big thing and by having more people on my page and me sharing the products every single day that's um, I didn't have it Instagram and I have 1500 something followers now and then I uh, had like 300 ish Facebook friends and I have 5,000 <laughs> so I like literally grew my market like this like this and I think that is what exploded my business from the beginning because I had so many eyes on my stuff <laughs> yeah 
That's crazy. They didn't even teach us how to grow our Facebook back in the day. That was not a thing. We, they taught us how to grow our Instagram. So I grew my, I had 129 Instagram followers and now I have like 8,000 um, over it <laughs> because I just didn't know what else to do. But now I, I am growing my Facebook, so I have a lot on there too. But okay, so my first four customers, I did post. Um, my now sister-in-law, Heather, saw stuff about the wraps. Because back then we did not have the same products. Like we did not have nearly the amount of products that you guys have. And so I post about the wraps because that was the product we were supposed to lead with. And so um, she saw that and was my first customer from seeing a post. I posted multiple times. She didn't just see one post and be like, I'm going to sign up. Um, but she saw the <laughs> posts that I made, even though no one liked them or commented on them, I still made them. And so she saw them and then I signed up. Um, I actually... I said to Courtney when I signed up, I was not having an in-person party. Like I didn't do that because I'm never home and I'm very shy. And I was like, I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. And so I mustered up some courage and invited over Marla does my hair because I've been, I've known her for forever. And two of my really good friends in the area, I didn't even grow up here. So I don't have that many friends here. And so th three people came over. I invited more than that, but three people came over and Two of them tried the wraps. I forgot to ask them for the money for the wraps. Don't do that. Ask the people for the money. I was too nervous. I did not even like talking to people. Um, and one of them signed up as a customer, right? So one from posting, one from having an in-person party at my house. Three people came. My sister was like, I'll host a party for you because she's more introverted than me. And I was like, okay. <laughs> And I had to go down south for work anyway, because I drove all around. And so I was like, all right, we'll plan a day when I'm down there and we'll, you can invite people. So our old neighbor, my mom's old neighbor came and was one of my first customers. And I'll be honest with you guys, I totally bribed my brother to get some hair, skin and nails from me. I was like, I need one more customer. It was my last day. I was like, I need one more customer. I'm competitive for this. I need you to be a customer. And I like basically. So. That was my first four customers. Um, it was from posting. It was from it, just telling people about it. I mean, yeah, I had the party, and that's, I totally recommend doing a launch party, even though I hated it. Um, it wasn't bad, actually, after doing it, but I was not happy about it. But I did it, right? And I didn't die, and I signed customers from it. So I recommend doing that, even if it's just like a meetup at a Starbucks or something. You didn't have to be at your house. Um, and then forcing my brother. <laughs> that was my first four. For sure. So, yeah. Um, so that's your first goal. So aside from that, that's what I want you guys to focus on. Just asking people. Honestly, there's, we have scripts in the team page that you can use. Feel free to copy and paste. Um, when you go to that file, in the files tab that says, if you're on my team page and watching this, that says, um, I'm new, where do I start? The first one is a welcome video, blah, 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 blah. Skip all the way down to scripts to use. And it's a Google Doc. It's my Google Doc. It says all of Jack, it's just the scripts. And then the first one um, is new distributors use these. And I have scripts right there for you to use. So you can click those and you can use them. You can copy and paste it. I don't care. Make it sound like you if you want to. Um, and it's just super duper simple. It literally says, just call, say I'm talking to my mom. Hey mom, I started something new. I'm a little nervous, but very excited. I ran up with a health and beauty company and I need a little help. I need a few testimonials and I thought of you because I trust your opinion. You would get a huge discount for life and I'll be here to help you with whatever goals you have. It's all health and skincare related. Would you be open to taking a look? And then you can just, and then there's another one right below that, like another script, like literally just says like, okay, which categories interest you the most? It's all right there for you to use. So you don't even have to think about it. It's just there. Just copy and paste it. <laughs> it's easy. Um, so you can be reaching out to people, texting people, or messaging people on Facebook that way, because I did that too, and I know Laura did that. Um, so that's that. That's reaching out. Hopefully that's all making sense. If you have questions, you can just fill up that. But um, like Laura said, she didn't have a good warm market. She didn't have friends and family that were very supportive. And it happens. It happens. I had a few that were, but um, she grew her network really, really fast. And I have a whole video in that newbie file on how to grow your network 
on Instagram and Facebook, just depending on what you use. So you can go in there and check that out. It's so easy, you guys. It takes like zero time to like friend new people, add new people. I'm not messaging those people right away, just to be clear. I'm not messaging, I'm not adding people and messaging them right away. They're just watching my posts because I'm posting every single day about the products and the business. And then they're like, what are you doing? What is that coffee? <laughs> Why does your life look so good? Why, why do you look so happy all the time? <laughs> yeah. um, positivity and excitement. You could know nothing. You could literally know about zero product. You could know, I didn't even know you were supposed to sign distributors. I didn't know that was a good thing or not. I didn't know what I was doing. I just talked about how excited I was. And I picked a few goals that I went after that I just talked about, right? So I wanted to pay down my student loan debt for my master's degree. Student loan debt sucks. So I wanted to pay it down. I talked about it. I talked about how this was going to help me go on a trip with Glenn. I wanted to go to the UK. I talked about it. And I talked about how I was going diamond. I didn't even know what that meant. I just knew there was like, a bo at the time there was a bonus for it, but on, and there's going to, there's going to be at the end of the month, so don't worry. But, um, I'm sure they're going to come out with something at conference, but at the same time, it doesn't matter. I just tell people I'm going for diamond. It's $2,000 a month. And that, two, that extra $2,000 a month is going to help me do this, that, whatever. And guys, like, I know that it sounds crazy to say that something's going to do something for you when you're just new and you, you know, you're brand new and you're like, how do I know? How do I know that this is going to change my life? It's up to you. You make that decision. There's no crystal ball. I could have never known that, like, if I worked really hard, I could be where I'm at. That was not, I didn't know, you know, but if you just make that decision that you're just going to work really hard and they're going to make it happen, then guess what? You're going to work really hard. You're going to be in it, in it with us, asking all the questions, doing all the things, stepping out of your comfort zone and trying new stuff and falling down and getting back up and falling down and getting back up and you're going to come to the top with us. So if that's what you want, then we're here for it and we will help you the whole way. Um, but you have to make that decision ultimately. And believe me, I was the person that like really cared about what other people thought of me. I really did before I made any decision. I, <laughs> I was just that person. And I know there are people like that where they really care and they really get nervous. And like, I don't want to annoy someone. I don't want to, you know, bombard people. And if you're just excited about something, regardless of what it is, other people are going to be nice to you about it. And, and if they're not, then they're not someone that you want in your, in your life. Like, it's just not. My, one of my best friends has never been a distributor or customer with me, and I've been with this for years. And it's not because she's not interested. It's fine. You know, like, I don't, she's so supportive of me. So the right people are going to be there, and they're going to support you. I'm just rambling. So, Laura, anything before I keep rambling? <laughs> <laughs> no, you're good. <laughs> um, and like she was saying, like you already took the leap of faith to begin and start this journey. You might as well continue to have that faith and run with it, you guys. Like it's it's worth it. <laughs> yeah. And um, just because I'm the person that's like, okay, what do you physically do? That's what I want to know and how to get started. Um, in that file that I was talking about, that newbie file on the team page, it says in there the four things that I do. I've done the same four things since I've been, the same four things, right? You can do four things a day. I am posting about the business and the products every day. You go on the team page, look and see how we post, look on my page, look on Laura's page, look on whosoever pages, your upline, whoever. There's actually a whole file on people that you can go look at their pages, see what they're posting about um different leaders in the company so i'm posting every single day it's like opening the doors for your business right if you had a coffee shop you'd have to <clears throat> unlock your doors to let people in so that's what i do every day to unlock my doors let people in um i'm growing my network just like laura said because i did not want to rely on friends and family i knew that i could not get to the top of the company just by the friends and family that i knew because who knows when they're going to be ready to try this if ever right like i just said my best friend still has never been a customer distributor so um, I grew my network really fast, just like Laura, so that I could not have to rely on anyone else. And 99% of people that join me are, cus are people I never knew, like, or whatever, they're strangers <laughs> from around the world um, because of social media, which is really fun. And I, I message people. I message people from the very beginning. All the messages, all the scripts, the 
ever need are right in there. I just told you where they were in that file, the newbie, like, what do, what do I do? There's a whole script, all different kinds of scripts in there. So go there. Um, use, use the scripts, use it, do whatever you want with it, make it your own. Um, but if you don't tell people about this, they're not going to know. And it doesn't matter if they say yes, no, or not. And I know that that might sound weird to a newbie is like, what do you mean? I want them to say yes. I know you want everyone to say yes. And so I love this analogy. Ready? If you went into a diner, right? And a server would come up to you and ask you if you wanted coffee. That's what they do at diners. I don't know. Maybe I'm just a stigma, but every diner I've been to, they come up to me and say, you want some coffee? Some people don't like coffee. It is what it is. Some people just don't drink it. So they would say, oh, no, thank you. And the, like, the server is not going to run away crying, you guys. They're not going to run away being like, oh, my God, I should not be a server because someone just told me, no, this is a sign. I need to quit right now. Like, they wouldn't do that. They would be like, okay, cool. Like, move on to the next table. Ask them if they want coffee. Right? So what I'm asking, you know, when Courtney asked me and I said no, she didn't quit. If she did, I wouldn't be here, right? So she just kept like, okay, cool, Jackie's not interested. I'm gonna go to the next person. And she kept posting about it and talking about it and growing her business and doing all the things and kept asking more and more and more people. And honestly, some of those people that said no to her came back and said yes later. So it's okay. Your job is literally to plant all the seeds, right? <clears throat> if you had one seed in the ground, that seed might grow eventually, and it might not. Not every seed grows, right, that you put in the ground. If you've ever put seeds yeah. in, I have a ground. <laughs> but if you had a field of seeds, think of how many would grow. You gave them water and sunlight, you're posting, you're, <clears throat> it up, you're telling them, you know, what this is gonna do for you. Think of how many would grow, a ton you would have a huge field of all these plants. <laughs> so you would have a huge field of all these team members, <laughs> a huge team. Um, but you have to, and a lot of customers, you're going to have to tell them about it. And it's okay if they say, no, not right now, or, you know, maybe later I'm not interested or ignore you and just don't say anything. I get all those things too every single day. It's fine. Um, but it's up to me to tell people because what if that person that I'm afraid to tell is sitting there crying to themselves. I cried on the couch for like 30 minutes the day that I messaged Courtney because I did not want to leave my husband again to leave the house to go where I had to go. I literally sat there crying on the couch. And so I know that there's someone else out there that like their life might look perfect and they might have their master's degree with an awesome job, but they might <clears throat> cry themselves on the couch and I don't even know it. And so I don't want to not tell people about this. I would feel so bad if someone needed this and I didn't tell them. And that's just where my mindset is. And so I just tell everyone, whether they say yes, no, or ignore me, I tell them. Um, so posting, growing your network, messaging, and then follow up. If anyone says like, oh yeah, I'll listen. Or like, yeah, what, what weight loss products do you have? Or, um, you know, I, I, I'm really busy right now, but maybe, maybe in a few months, this would be an option for me or whatever. I write their name down in a notebook write them down in a notebook put their name down you're not going to remember them later i promise you well, i can't um i have a whole list back from june of 2014 <coughs> i have people from back then that i'm still talking to that are still on my list because they haven't told me no yet so they're still on my list um so make sure to write people down and follow up because I'm busy, you guys. If if I talked to someone, I used to buy lip scents from this girl, right? Lip scents is another MLM. I guess it's still around. And so I really wanted this one color. And she kept messaging me and messaging me. And I was like, I, I was busy. And I was like, oh my gosh, I sorry, sorry, girl. Like, I keep forgetting. Like I'm not, <laughs> not, not ignoring you. I just keep forgetting. <laughs> People are busy. They're not sitting around thinking, oh, I was gonna get Thermofidex from Laura. <laughs> They're like, oh my God, this child's throwing up or, you know, my boss is like down my throat about this report. They're thinking about their own lives. They're not thinking about you. And so it's my customer service job to follow up with them and be like, hey, I know that you were looking for this weight loss product. We have an awesome 40% off um, as a loyal customer. You know, I don't say loyal customer, but I say you can get 40% off right now as a customer. Um, you know, I'm putting in orders right now. Did you, did you want me to put your order in too? 
And they're just going to be like, oh my gosh, thank you so much for reminding me or whatever the situation is, or, oh my gosh, I don't get paid till Friday or I don't get paid till next week or whatever it is. Um, so follow up fortunes in the fall. I've never signed up a person without following up. Yeah. If we're Someone I just signed up this week, I spoke to when I first started in June. So six months later, I just signed them up and that was from following up. Yeah. And another great thing when you're follow or writing people down, you guys, it's so important. Don't think that you don't have to write it down. Just do it because <laughs> it, it, it helps. So when I write, when I write it down, I write their name. And then if it's for a product, I like write the product next to it, or if I just keep my distributors on one side. And when we come out with amazing sales, you guys, I easily open my notebook and I'm like, oh, TFX, this person wanted it. Oh, this person wanted TFX. Oh, and I can message everyone like this. <laughs> so please just write it down. It'll make your life amazingly easy, especially when our company releases amazing product releases or BOGOs or anything like that. It is awesome. <laughs> Yes, agreed. I always write down the product or products multiple that they wanted. Or if they're just interested in weight loss, I'll write down like weight loss because if right now we have an awesome weight loss package that's on sale right. for our customers. So I can go back to those people. Okay. Um, if anyone has questions, like I said, put them in the comments. Um, so those are the four things that I do. It's just that simple and just that easy. Some people do, you know, in-person parties, they do more in-person, which is perfect. And you can do that. And if you're sitting there like, eh, social media, I'd rather go in person, go do parties, go, there's vendor events that are very cheap. You can set up a table for free in like salons and gyms and things like that. Like if that is your jam, go do that. Like go do in-person stuff because they're going to be face to face with you and have that connection faster. Um, but like I said, like you can be doing this on social media too. So it works either way. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, okay. So my son is three and he was, um, he had his little fake golf club, whatever, his Fisher Price golf club out earlier. And I heard him from here and he was like, I guess, putting the ball into this little thing and he would go, oh, I made it, you know, and then he would put it again and go, oh, I missed. And I'd be like, oh, it's okay, buddy. Like put the ball back and try again. And he'd do it again. Oh, I missed. And I'd be like, it's okay. I just put the ball back and try it again. And so, you know, it's funny because you will tell kids, it's fine. Just get back up and keep going. He wasn't like, oh, I missed. I must be really bad at golf and therefore I will never try it again. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Most of us are... We try something and if we feel like we got a response that we didn't like and something's uncomfortable, that it's not for us. That's our immediate response, right? If you went to a gym, you know that you're gonna be uncomfortable. You know you're gonna be sweating. You know that you're gonna be sore. You know that in advance when you go there. You expect it. You expect to be uncomfortable. You know that you have to be uncomfortable in order to grow your body and grow stronger. But whenever it happens anywhere else in life, we tend to think, oh, this isn't for us. Don't be that person. Don't be that person. You're gonna fall down. You're not gonna be very good at first. It's okay. I sucked. I was not very good. And here I am making an amazing income, living out a dream life and just running for more. You know, yeah. so that's the biggest thing that I could tell you is that you're going to fall down a bunch of times. You're going to have to ask a million questions. You're going to not really know what you're doing. You're going to fumble over your words. I literally was sitting in front of someone that wanted to sign up as a distributor. I was so excited. I was telling her all the things and she literally was like, this is too much. And she closed her computer and she didn't sign up that day. She eventually did sign up, but <laughs> I, I I sucked too and it's okay <laughs> I feel like that's the biggest thing that holds people back is they're just afraid of people seeing them suck I guess but no one knows if you're putting out there like I did like I'm gonna go diamond I'm gonna make two thousand dollars a month with this this is gonna help me pay off my student loan debt this is gonna help me go on vacations I said that all the time to pe people were probably I thought they were probably sick of me saying it and I kept getting messages in my inbox, people messaging me saying, what are you doing? You sound so excited. I want to be a part of that. And I was on a triple diamond, making a lot of money. 
I didn't have a story yet. I was brand new. And people were still coming to me asking me what I was doing because my excitement was like <laughs> patching onto them and they just wanted to be a part of it. So if I can tell you anything tonight, I know I told you a lot of stuff. If you're gonna take anything away, be excited, be pumped, be so excited that people don't even know. They won't even know how to be mean to you about this if that's something that you're afraid of because that was something I was afraid of. I was like, if I'm just so excited, people won't even know how to be mean to me about it. And they weren't, no one's mean to me about it. But you know, like they're just gonna be, wanna do it too. And I, I just, I use that as like a defense almost, like an offense, whatever. But it, it worked for me. It worked for everyone that I know that's done that. And so you don't have to know the ins and outs and how to do all the things. We're here to help you with that. All you have to do is know where you want to go, what you want to do with this, and just talk about it until you're blue in the face. <laughs> and people will want to do this with you. And they'll be pumped about it with you. Good. That's literally the secret right there. That's the secret. <laughs> be excited. It's all you got to do. And people want to do this with you. So anyway, I know it's almost been an hour. Any closing final thoughts? No, I think we nailed it. And I don't see any questions in the chat group, so it must not be too confusing. <laughs> Go ask people. Just tell everyone you know about what we've got here and be excited about it. That's literally all you got to do. There's no secret. No secret. That's crazy that's happening here. I'm not doing any special things. I, honestly, at this point, I barely even talk about my story because people don't even really care about where I've been in the past. They want to know where I'm going. So <laughs> I'm telling people where I'm going and people are pumped to go with me. That's it. That's all I got. All right. Perfect. Thank you guys so much for jumping on. We really appreciate it. We'll be uploading this to the team pages too, so you can review it. And I think that's about it. Yeah. Bye. Thank you guys. Bye. <laughs> Bye.